Hey Greens! So here we go with another vlog. I wanted to talk a little bit more about sculpting, but we're also going to do some unboxing, but I also got a pretty cool gift I wanted to show you too. I do hear many of you saying, Jackie, we want you to do some more sculpting. I hear you. I know. But the issue is, when it comes to sculpting, for some reason, I don't know what it is because I'm, I'm trying to stay as conscious as possible of my posture, but then I get destroyed. My back hurts, my shoulder hurts, my joints are in pain. I'm like, ah. <laughs> so my guess is probably has to do with the amount of time that it takes me to sit down and sculpt. And because I do have hyper focused attention, when I sculpt, I don't realize that, hey, I've been doing this for six hours straight. Because in my own mind, I'm like, oh, it's only been 45 hours. And I'm like, oh, <laughs> oops. <laughs> Let me know if you're the same. All that to say is I found a new favorite. So I used to use Sculpey 3 because it was the softest and easiest for me to use. However, ever since I discovered Cosplay last year, oh my God, at first it's a little hard, but the second you start kneading it, it almost like it, it takes the form and the shape of your hand. It just, well, not, not that it melts, but it works so well. This is not promo, not sponsored or anything, but it's gotten me really, what's the word? excited to sculpt again if that makes sense so with the help of my helpers yes i'm looking at you jane editing this video right now we're making a small area where i can sit down and sculpt on my free time and it's not going to take over my desk space that is for recording videos however these sculpting videos will not be full videos it'll be just like progress videos of me doing my own sculptures on my own time that's going to be mixed media they're not going to be videos for tutorials or here's how to sculpt or watch me sculpt it's going to be like here's what i want to do here's the progress a few hours later a few days later because for you it's going to be it's going to look like the same video for me it's going to be like throughout multiple days so i don't sit more than half an hour an hour max and work on it so yeah i'm super excited i think i was just like playing around with this but yeah i'm excited to have a small sculpting corner in order to sculpt but not as a tutorial because those just don't work on youtube and i'm sure you've seen videos from jazza and other creators we're doing just pure art pure sculptures is not a thing that a lot of people watch nowadays it's mostly about entertainment and just taking it easy, chill, hangout kind of style. With that said, today we're going to be unboxing more of these little mystery box things. Let me show you what these are. Hang on. There we go. They're called Fairy Tale Demo and it is by Popmart. They sent these to me a lot. There you go. Popmart. They sent these to me such a long time ago and I did unbox them. <laughs> I did them. I keep unboxing them. I think it's been like three years and I still have them in my cupboard. I'm like, I'm going to unbox them slowly. Sure enough, it's way slower than I expected. By the way, for those of you who wanted to watch the unboxing videos, they are unlisted. I'll leave it down below for you to watch. And look at that. These are the different characters that we can get. So this is the fairy tale series. We can get Little Riding Hood, the wolf. What is this? Prince what? Prince Tangled? Okay. So we have Prince Tangled. Let's get you closer. We have the Frog Prince, the Ugly Duckling. We have the Swown, a Dragon, a Warrior, an Elf. Elf of Flower? Okay. It's always a funny word every time I say it. An Alchemist, a Wizard, and then a Question Mark. I don't know what the Question Mark is, but it looks like a chess piece for some reason. Oh, we are still close. Hello. <laughs> But also the cool gift I was sent by Black Magic, who make the most gorgeous cinematic cameras I have ever seen. So shout out to Terry for sending me this pocket cinematic camera and the ATEM Mini, which I'm still trying to figure out the best way to set them both up. But I want to unbox the camera with you. So let's let's do that. So basically the reason I want to unbox this with you, let me do this here is because I want to take b-roll, basically footage of things, with this one for this video. Now I don't know if it comes with a lens, I'm not sure, otherwise I'm going to have to take it off of my other camera. So we're going to do that. Where are you? I'm so excited. As long as I can remember, I've always wanted one when I was a little, little channel. I was like, oh, this is so pretty. 
ready. Okay, let's do this. I really want to see footage and show you footage with this of these little guys. This is basically going to be our camera kind of testing. So once we unbox these, I'll take footage with this camera. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, we have all the stuff here, which I'm going to read on the side. We have our charger for the battery. Ooh, okay, we have our plugs, depending on where you are in the world. Our little stripe. Okay, this is, this is where it is. <gasps> it comes with a lens. Oh my god. Oh, that is a beast. Holy shrimp. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, this is exciting. Here's the screen. Oh, I messed it up. Here's the screen in the back. It doesn't flip forward. Oh, you can see. Oh, hello. I can see you. <laughs> so it doesn't flip forward, but from what I could read is that it does just lift to make it easier for you to see. So that's one of the things I have to keep in mind is that I can't see myself if it's facing this way, so I can't record myself per se, but I can record other stuff and little footage of things. Oh my god, I'm gonna get that charging. My god, that is a beast. Holy shrimp. And then what's, what's you? Oh, the battery. Okay, we're gonna get this charged up. Seriously, Black Magic, thank you so much for making me a part of the Black Magic family. These cameras have been my dream since I was a tiny, tiny channel. All right, so it doesn't come with a lens. I thought this was a lens because it was protruding, but no, that's totally fine. I have one right up here and I will eventually get a dedicated lens for this one. Super excited. From what I understand, at least what I've read, I'm, I'm, I'm very much a skimmer and I like to learn on the spot. <laughs> From what I understand is this is compatible with all sorts of lens types. So I'm excited. We, we gonna do this. I'm charging it now and then we're gonna take some footage with it and it's gonna be smexy and well maybe not at first because I'm still learning to use it but let's let's give it some time to charge So it turns out that my current one on this camera does not fit this one. I probably should have read the instructions. So I'm gonna have to go out and pick up a lens for this beast. And then we're gonna go take some test shots probably sometime next week. At least the good news with the camera is that we have a place like 25 minutes away and they have lenses of all kinds and shapes. So I'm gonna bring it with me and get the best lens I can get for it. Okay, what do we want? Let me know in the comment section below which one of these characters do you want the most? Let's hope for the secret. We have four of them to unbox. So let's see if we can get the secret character and what it is. Oh gosh, of course. <laughs> and of course, we're not gonna peek at the spoiler card. All right, what we got here, we have Oh, the fairy, the flower of the fit. No, wait, that's the swan. Say what? The flower fairy, right? No, the swan. <laughs> I was like, the flower fairy. That's not, they kind of do look the same. I think the colors, but here we go. Let's get a darker background. My felt. I love you, my felt. And here is our swan character. Absolutely beautiful. The gradients and the shading. Look at this swan. It's so beautiful. So pretty, pretty. Look at this character. I really love these pop figurines. I need a display for them. That's something I need to work on when I redecorate the room. I know this is not the butt, but it kind of looks like the butt. <laughs> All right, next one. Is it going to be... Very nice. Is it going to be our... Oh, it's true. I forgot to show you. We don't look on the inside because... We usually get the spoiler, so here's the card of the character, and here is what it looks like right there. So we try to avoid looking on the inside. We have these things, but put them away so the kitty cats don't get to them. And then, oh, let's not look at the card. I almost looked at the card. This one's a little bulky. Oh, green. This could be the one. This could be the one. And... 
No, it's the dragon! Oh my god, baby! Oh, that is adorable. Wait, does that move? No. Okay, so the arms don't... And it actually has a diaper. Look at that. I didn't realize when I said baby, it would actually be a baby dragon. I love this. I love this so much. It's an actual little dragon sitting right on top of the head. We see the tail. We see the little feet. We see the hands <laughs> grabbing the head. Oh my god, the face. I'm guessing these should be wings, but I feel like maybe they're just more claws? Ears? I feel like they're ears. I don't think there's wings. This is really cute. Yeah, that is adorable. Especially the character here has the light skin tone going down to the purplish color. Beautiful. Love it, love it, love it. This is cute. By the way, these figurines have a nice heft to them. They're not light and bad quality. Here's the card for a little dragon. I love this one. So we got the baby dragon and we got the swan. I wouldn't mind the frog, to be honest. If we're gonna get the baby dragon, I kind of want the frog. Let's go <laughs> for the next one. Okay, avoid the card. Oh, that one's bulky too. I feel like they're probably all bulky. And, oh, what are you? Oh, okay, it's not the frog. What are you? Is it the wolf? Oh no. <laughs> It's Granny Wolf! This one's not a quite a full wolf. It's more like a Granny Wolf hat. It has a little scar. Look at them glasses. Oh, they move. The little tongue sticking out, the bonnet. Look at the devious little face with the little fang. More scars. They're all little baby characters. Oh, wait. Why are there holes in the hand? Does it hold something? Is there something in here? No. Okay. In here? Oh, oh, wait, 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 there's something here. Let me just double check. Okay, this one didn't have any holes in the hand. Neither did this one, just the wolf. All right, let's open you. From what I could see, it's a fork and a knife. That is hilarious. Let's get you out. So tiny, so, so, so tiny. All right, one hand over here. Oh gosh, the sausage fingers. Oh, the sausage fingers, give me a second. And here. Here is our character with a fork and knife ready to devour Little Red Riding Hood. I think I have Little Red Riding Hood somewhere, so they definitely have to be together. Very cute. And this is box number four. Here's hoping for the froggy, Furok Prince, and maybe the secret character. Put your bits. Oh no. <laughs> Put your bets down below. Which one do you think? we're going to be getting. Alright, I got you. Let's get you away. We don't see the card. It feels a little small. Okay. Let's see our color. <gasps> I think it's the frog! <laughs> My gosh! Oh, frog prince! I love him! With all the little details on the clothing, holy shrimp. Look at the details on the clothing, the little frills everywhere. He has different layers of clothing. I love the orange pants, the shoes. And then we have the frog. That is adorable. So the frog, we still don't see the definition of the legs in the same way that we see with the dragon character, interestingly enough. Kind of blobby, like the wolf. Wolf, we don't see any kind of definition specifically. That is cute. We have the crown right on top. I love these. These are adorable. So here are the characters that we got in this unpacking. I thought this was really fun. And I really do hope that you're as excited as I am to see little tidbits of me sculpting. Again, for fun, for pleasure, for me. But I'll take you along the journey with me. And again, a huge thank you to Black Magic. I am so sorry I don't have proper lenses, so I'm gonna go and pick up a lens next time. <laughs> thank you so much for watching, my little grains. Until then, I'll see you in the next video.